Well, good evening and welcome to Milan. Welcome to the Mediolanum Forum for round 22 action in the Turkish Airlines EuroLeague. AX Armani Exchange Milan's Kevin Punter has established himself as one of the continent's most lethal scorers. In round 22 of this season, Punter had the biggest night of his career, coming against former side Olympiakos Piraeus. And just last year, Kevin Punter had 11 games with Olympiakos. He's in his first full season with Milan, and he is the team's leading scorer. To be honest, it's like any other game. Um, it wasn't, I didn't go into that game mentally, physically, any feeling any different. You know, it was just another game we knew we knew we needed to win. Obviously, I'm playing against my ex-team, but, um, you know, we wanted to get the win. We played well, and that was that. Yeah, great ball movement by Milan. And Punter obliges with the corner three-pointer. I put a lot of hours in the summer, a lot of hours, you know, after practice or whatnot. So, you know, for my teammates to trust me is, is definitely, you know, and my coaching staff is definitely, uh, is definitely great. Punter with a deep three! Oh, Kevin Punter strings it from distance! I've been doing it all my life. To be honest with you, uh, you can't guard me. That's the only thing I just feel like. That's those situations like that is stuff I've been working on all my life. So it's like situations where I got the ball and it's just me and that other defender. I just I work on that too many times. I real I feel real confident about myself in situations like that. Punter from distance. Got it! Kevin Punter shows Olympiacos how to do it! Can't, you can't really care, to be honest with you. You know, if you miss two shots, you can't start thinking too much, and now nah, you just gotta keep playing. You gotta keep going. You can't be scared to shoot certain shots. Punter with a three. Count it! Kevin Punter punctuates a win for Olympia Milano. With Milan looking like a favorite to book a playoff spot, talk now shifts to championship ambitions. From my rookie year till now, I just wanted to grow offensively and defensively in, in all aspects. It was nothing that was really like specific for me. I want to get better in this area. Like not nah, for me, it was just like in every aspect of the game, I want to grow and get better. So that's what I've done from my rookie year in Greece up until now. That was my goal at least. You know, most people are going to demand a lot from you, so you got to be willing to take it, you know? So, especially if you say you want to win and you want to be successful. But you don't come into the season thinking you can't win at all. So for us, we just we just try to take it game by game. Don't look too far ahead and just try to build each and every single day. Definitely, it's definitely possible. Uh, just got to handle, you handle your business, you know? Like, you can look at the standings and you can do it all you want, but I feel like that's, what we're trying to do, just handle our business, stay focused, and just let that stuff take care of itself.